Hi there you guys, Michael Scooby 71 here and today I'm going to do my uh, review of my Browning Buckmark Camper. It's a 22 caliber pistol, uh, 22 long rifle and uh, it uh, just basics about it. Uh, takes a 10 round magazine like such. Um, also uh, it has a bull barrel um, adjustable sights at the back here. Um, the front post is not adjustable, um, not that you need it to be. Uh, I'm going to talk about the features I like about it and uh, maybe a couple things I don't like about it. Um, first of all, uh, it has a bull barrel which is very thick for the caliber. Um, I like that it is, uh, it's accurate because of that, it's very accurate. Um, but, uh, again, there's a weight issue there. Uh, this isn't the kind of pistol you want to carry around on you for, I don't know, like a five-hour hike or something such as that. Um, uh, I like the grips. It just feels like it fits right into your hand, just, you know, like, properly. There's no issues there. Really like the grips. Um, other thing about it I like is that, um... The uh, trigger, and uh, just to double check, it's unloaded. I will double check that. Yep. Um, so, just going to show you the trigger pull. The magazine needs to be in it to fire. I like it, it's very clean and crisp. Um, I have painted the front post orange because that's another problem I found with it. It can be a little challenging to uh, acquire the sights. Um, but again, that orange front post helps me do that. Um, the magazine release is good, but it's not ambidextrous. It's just for right-handed shooters right there. Um, this is your safety at the back here. It's very easy to turn up, push on and push off. Um, no real complaints about it, um, other than the feature I really don't like is the slide. Um, the slide, you have access to the chamber from the side only. I would prefer that the entire part comes back, the entire slide is, there is no front or top post here so that you have access to the chamber from the top like a normal pistol such as a Glock um, but other than that that's that's really it and it's not a big deal but it just means that the takedown for cleaning is a little bit more involved um, I like the grips quite a bit they came stock with these rubber grips um, price for me was um, a little over 300 and uh, I bought an extra magazine. I didn't like that Browning doesn't give you an extra magazine, but whatever, you know, it is what it is. In any case, um, like the video, subscribe, and uh, again, I don't have to tell you, guns are fun, but be safe.